fear. Fear murdered my parents. On the far side of the world, I tasted fear in its purest form and thought I had conquered it. But fear followed me home. Got arson. I've alerted the fire department, sir. You should be able to find an exit to an empty. Not until I find Crane. About the gimp. What about him? We're gonna leave him locked up while this place burns? Hell yeah. Crane's got the poor bastard gassed out of his mind. He'd tear our lungs out if we took him off that chain. I say let him burn. Put him out of his misery. Hey! Hey! I'm a friend! Here. Double time hey, with you two. I want to be out of here now. This place is gonna blow. Run! Said then. Sorry, my darlings. But I have what I need. Batman. Fascinating. I'd kill for a look inside your head. But luckily, I've got my patience to do that for me.
It was the same, the same fear that made me become. In the darkness of my parents' murder, I caught a glimpse of something I've been looking for ever since. I lost myself in the world, searched in all the shadows. I seek the means to fight injustice. To manipulate the fears in others. You must first master your own. Are you ready to begin? The one I got here must be Califal. Maxura no ne kuni paishatiye. Raz al Ghul says that if you want to be Death's journeyman, you cannot fear it. Ready or not, Death does not wait. Death is not considerate or fair. And make no mistake. In this chamber, you are facing death. Do not return to this room until you are ready to join the League of Shadows. This way, Wayne. There is no space in the League for hesitation. You've already tempered your fists. I know you understand violence, but anger alone will not win your battles. The ninja is thought invisible, but invisibility is largely a matter of patience and distraction. Attack one of the three men before you. Show me you have the wisdom to be ruthless. Wayne. If you run, you will be discovered easily. Stealth is your greatest ally. Enemies with weapons are the most dangerous. Always attack them first, without mercy. Destroy the strongest of your opponents first, and others will fear you and fall at the mercy you deny them. We'll carry on. You would not have come to this place if you were seeking out the easiest path. This way is barred. Find another way through. There are more ways around a door than a key. Throwing weapons are a ninja's hand, not his fist. By them, a man alone may surround and confuse his enemies. Shuriken wait before you. Take them, and I will train you in their use. 
shuriken wait on the far side of those flames. Jitsu will make you invisible and immortal in the minds of your enemies, but you will still be nothing but a man. You cannot walk through flame, so find a way around. Always mind your surroundings, Wayne. Every gift is a potential trap. Look around your environment for opportunities, Wayne. Your environment will only work to your advantage if you make it do so. Use the shuriken to create a path before you. Can't enter there until you have completed one last challenge. Follow me. In the room beyond, you'll find your next to final test, one of intimidation. The three ninja in the next chamber have been instructed on pain of death to keep the passphrase from you. Don't make your presence known until you've become a wraith in their minds. I've left you a gift in the room beyond. Use it to convince them you are more terrible than death, and they will give you the words. Use the wires above to cross without alerting the men below. Did Ducard tell you what to expect? Quiet. I don't trust Wayne. He's not one of us. There is a violence to him. All the more reason for silence. Use your environment, Wayne. Break the support cable with the shuriken. Show them fear. Did that. He's out of his mind. He's one man and still in training. We can handle him. Now, Wayne, they are ready. They are weak with fear. Finish them off. You know what I want. Please! Don't... The guard would kill me. And I'll make you wish I would. What's the passphrase? Please! It's... Looking Glass. Don't tell the guard I told you.
looking glass. Welcome. What is this? I guard the explosives. They're safe, ready for your return to Gotham. Welcome, Wayne. We have come to your final lesson. Lower the prisoner in his cage. Excellent. Now, come here. We have purged your fear. You are ready to lead. Ready to become one of the League of Shadows. But first, you must demonstrate your commitment to justice. He is a murderer and a thief. He cannot be allowed to live. No. I'm no executioner. You must have the will to act. Or you are not fit to lead these men into Gotham. Gotham? As its favorite son, you are ideally placed to strike at the heart of criminality. That city has become a festering wound of suffering and injustice. It cannot be saved and must be allowed to die. You can't believe in this. Wayne, what are you doing? What needs to be done? Way. You will die. Al Ghul, the League of Shadows. They were nothing but ashes now. My mentor had shown me everything I could find without losing myself. So I left a card behind. I came back home. I'm gonna show the people of Gotham their city doesn't belong to the criminals and the corrupt. As a man, I'm flesh and blood. I can be ignored, I can be destroyed, but as a symbol, as a symbol, I can be incorruptible. I can be everlasting. What symbol? separate him from his thugs, but he's arranged for a police presence as well. No doubt crap, sir. I still can't attack them directly. I'll need a way around. I'll search Gotham Records for an alternative route. Hey, sir, you do have an optic cable. It could give you advantage on what threats these doors hide.
It's some kind of cat. Let's talk. What are you? You're one of Falcone's men. What's he doing here? Please, you don't know Falcone. He's horrible. I'm here. He isn't. And I'm worse. What's he doing? <laughs> Smuggling. Shipments come in from Southeast Asia weekly. Falcone cuts them up, hands them out to his dealers, but... Keep talking. <laughs> Something's different this time. Something's happening in the sewers. And Falcone wouldn't start pulling favors with the cops unless he was... Unless he was what? Scared. How about you? I'm freaking terrified. Ooh. Please, I got a kid. Alfred, any news from police radio on boats? Yes, sir. Gotham police have at least one squad of marksmen on the water. I wouldn't suggest putting yourself within their range. Then I'm gonna need access to the sewers. I'll mark the nearest entrance point on your radar, sir. If I may, Master Bruce, the number of men waiting in that van may be too great a force for even you to take on single-handed. Only if it's a fair fight. That forklift might shift the odds a little more in my favor. What's got Falcone on edge? What? What? What in the name of... Falcone brought a small army for a simple cargo drop. What's he afraid of? I don't know. I, I think something's happening in the sewers. How do I find Falcone's shipment? Bears! I'm gonna need more than that. Puts the powder in pl plastic bags inside of stuffed bears. It's how he's done it for years. I don't know anything else.
won't work in all cases, but you are skilled enough that your pick should make short work of most locks. to test the tensile strength on the grapple. Could it be dangerous? The advantages are worth the risk. It gives me a higher vantage point than the drop on my enemies. Very sensible, sir. Just put down the gun, all right? I can't do that, Mac. Just let me through and you'll never see me again. Couldn't even if I wanted to. Uh, I don't have the key. And how the hell did you get over there? From the far side. Listen, I don't know what you guys are... He's <laughs> What are you? I'm here to help. I need to get deeper into the sewers. What's going on down here? These tunnels are filled with our men and now you... Whatever you are. I don't have time to explain. None of us do. Nobody's supposed to be here. The only reason I am is to survey for tomorrow's repair crew. The release valve on the dock's steam pipes rusted shut. If anybody opened up all the feed pipes, the whole system could burst. Would anybody be hurt? Probably not, but it would be pretty dramatic, and real expensive. How do I get to the feed pipes? There's a door behind you. The keypad code is my anniversary. 1227. You're not gonna do anything crazy, are do you? Do I look like I'd do something crazy? Where you are is as safe as you're gonna get. Keep your head down and wait for dawn. Ah, oh, man. I should have called in sick today. I have a feeling that Wayne Enterprises will be writing a check tomorrow to the Gotham Water Authority for steam damage. Just leave me a blank place to sign. And the feed pipe valves? There are three of them. I've located them on your radar, sir. We should hurry up and get the rest of it down here. Whatever's going on with these pipes is freaking me out. You and me both. It's no news to anybody that the dog is but insisting on taking the ship through the sewers is a new level of charity. I've heard rumors that the doctors have a Falcon ship and aid recreational. Yeah, there's all sorts of talk going around. All I know is, the sooner we're through with the job and out of here, the better.
Andy said you saw what was inside one of them rabbits. Yeah. So? So what? So don't be so mysterious. What is it? You got me. Not the stuff Falcone pushes. What did it look like? White, like powdered sugar. The guy who split it open was wearing a face mask and rubber gloves up to his elbow. Sounds serious. salary. <laughs> yeah, I bought the boat. Me and the wife are taking it over to Coast City next weekend. Nice. How about you? What are you doing with your bonus? Uh, I got an... It's some kind of costume freak! So what's with the rabbits? Because Falcone can't just ship in clear plastic bags. That's for his thing. They are. The rabbits are something new. The bears are standard powder. They go straight to the dealers. And the rabbits? They go somewhere in the narrows. What does that mean? That's all I know. I tried to push further. Falcone told me not to stick my nose anywhere. It might get cut off. Falcone's bulls, aren't you? Whatever pays the bills. What are you, one of the doctor's guys? Just a guy.
I need encryption prefixes. Right away, Master Bruce. You should be able to get into the machinery systems now. messed up. What in the hell happened? playing his cards close to his chest. Whoever he's working for has got him spooked. Somebody knows. His advocate, his, you know, what do you call it? Consigliere. He'd know. Falcone tells him everything. How do I find him? He's the only guy in the docks in a $500 suit who's not Falcone. What scares him? I don't know. Falcone. Small spaces. He could tell you everything. What are you doing over here? Sorry, what do you mean? Ain't you supposed to be Falcone's right-hand man? I had to get some air. They went down to the ship's hold, and I'm not, uh, comfortable with small spaces. Uh-huh. You know anything about Falcone's guy in the Narrows? I heard... It would be best if you didn't ask. Sure. Whatever. your worst. You'll get nothing from me. You're wasting your time. Falcone's already got me scared. There's nothing you can do to me. Shipment. 
How do I find it? That sounds like evidence. Falcone's crates. Exactly. I believe a large number are in the hold that have contained a ship docked nearby. Perfect. May I ask, sir? Perfect for what? Something dramatic. Something he can't hide. Hey, buddy. You talking to me? Nobody else here. I must be talking to you. That's funny. You got a light? Nah. What time, neither. You want the doctor's guys, right? Do you want to know? Just curious. The whole rabbit and bitch thing don't sit straight with me. Or why a loony bin head shrinker is all of a sudden interested in uh, drugs that ain't exactly medicine. Those ain't healthy curiosities. I'm afraid smoke grenades and other fear devices are only theatrics, Master Bruce. 
They'll only work on enemies already in a state of fear. Oh my... Did that. If Falcone sees that, we're good as dead. So get to work. It's just at the end of the pier. Help! He's here! Oh. You know who I work for! You're just a man! all over the docks. We'll find out who's responsible. We'll get on the horn to Peleg. I want my boat here, now. Get me the hell away from this disaster. Sir Falcone is being protected by a small army and a large arsenal. A forward attack may be too great a risk. This isn't a matter of force. Falcone's been beaten before. He knows he can always get back up. I want to get close. Show him my nightmare. Show him there's something on these streets more frightening than him. And how exactly do you intend to get close to him? Outside of using force? I'll bring him to me. That crane. Very creative, sir. One could almost believe that you enjoy this.
This can't be happening. Marvin too. They said it was some kind of creature, something like a man, but it couldn't be stopped. Anything that walks can die. I'm happy to prove it to any man here. Where's my damn boat? I called, but... Well, call again. Get down to the pier. Row the damn thing in if you have to. Yes, sir. I don't want to see your face again on dry land. Perfectly, sir. What are the rest of you standing around for? Get your guns out of your holsters and your heads out of your eyes. Anything moves, you kill it. If we've got questions, we'll ask the courses. Hello. Dear Lord, don't kill me. I need to get through that door. I, I have a key. Please, just don't hurt me. What's Falcone afraid of? I don't know. I just work for the guy, but I, I heard he doesn't like heights. I'll turn myself in. Just let me go. It. It's out there. You can count on help. What about all those cops? Forget about it. 
Everybody knows the Gotham PD is as dirty as a brothel's outhouse. If it's the Coast Guard, <laughs> they can't be too copacetic at Falcone's imports. It ain't the Coast Guard, it's the cops. And they're deeper in Mr. Falcone's pocket than lint. We got nothing to worry about. Intercepted a signal from Falcone's boat, Master Bruce. I'm afraid you only have a few moments before it docks. Still nothing, man. Thought I saw. that superstitious crap for the bush leagues. I want to know who he's working for and how I can hurt him. I'm not going to keep playing errand boy while that white collar geek crane barely lifts a finger. What in the name of... What the hell is going on? Somebody help me! Damn it, get me out of here! What in the name of... Get me down from here! What are you staring at, you slack-jawed morons? Lower this damn thing! Ah! What? What the hell are you? I'm Batman. We've got Falcone at the scene. Drugs, prints, cargo manifests. This bad character gave us everything. That's your nocturnal. That's maybe, but even for billionaire playboys, three o'clock is pushing it. The price for leading a double life, I fear. Bruce? It's not who you are underneath. It's what you do that defines you. I found an ally in a resource in Lucius Fox and Wayne Enterprises Applied Sciences Division. So what do you think? Does it come in black? Thanks, sir. It was love for bureaucracy. 
say we've got no idea what they stole. But whatever it was, it's big. They pulled it off in a big rig with a small army of cars running interference. So I'll need to take down that freight truck. Take him down! You'll have to get through its fleet of escort vehicles first. And I'm afraid they've hijacked the Paramount Bridge. You won't be able to get to it before they've raised it. That doesn't mean I can't cross it. Drive that thing into the scrap heap!
Lucius Fox on it. We need to find out what the missing weapon is before all of Gotham figures it out the hard way. Who was Falcone working for? What were the drugs and where were they going? Gordon's partner, Detective Flass, would know. You think Falcone will be in the pen long? Nah, the guy's got a bank account full of get-out-of-jail cards. Yeah, but we got a few days peace and quiet anyway. Yeah! Oh! The Batman! Help! He's here! <laughs> <laughs> oh! Like a church mouse. Did you find the GPD files? Of course, sir. And despite the enforced sabbatical you so kindly gave Falcone, the club remains quite active. You'll certainly find Detective Flass inside. How do I get in? You'll need a passphrase at the entrance. It changes daily, but the character of such a secret keeper would suggest that any number of the local gentlemen would likely share it, if properly persuaded. Just let me up. Not without the magic word. It's Jeff, you know me. We used to run birds on 10th Avenue. Without that passcode, I don't know you from Adam. Get lost. But something's wrong, something big. Sounds like a damn mortar landing. Fascinating. What's the passcode? I told you, man, I don't know. Then go play in traffic. Oh. How do I get upstairs? You're... you're real! I don't know! I don't know anything! If I let you live, <clears throat> what are you gonna do? Whatever you want me to do! Tell your friends <clears throat> what's come to Gotham. I, I, I'll tell them! I'll tell everybody! Oh.
So what? Does it, like, uh, cook things? Keep your panties on. It was probably just an accident. Did that look like an accident to you? We're good as dead. Shut up. I'm trying to listen. so bold, sir, if you don't leave any of these men conscious, no one will be left to interrogate for the past phrase. Ah! Help! He's here! <laughs> you know who I am! <laughs> I want inside the market. Then go. What's the magic word? Um, please, go! The passphrase for the door! Sorry, don't hurt me. The phrase is little pig. What about the microwave emitter? The what? A microwave weapon. You were driving the truck when it was stolen from Wayne Enterprises. That's all. I don't know nothing more about it. Who are you working for? Ah! I don't know. Some foreigner. Everybody's scared of him. I swear, I don't know nothing. That's all I know. I swear. I don't know nothing else. He'll kill me if he finds out I talked. Little pig, let me in.
found something that may be useful, Master Bruce. Detective Gordon has an informant inside the market. Is he still inside? Undoubtedly, sir. And according to his information, Falcone has the building covered with security cameras and booby traps. Where can I get a look at those camera views? It's a central security center, sir. Then that's how I find Flash and the traps both. It looks like I just found the first of Falcone's traps. It appears so, sir. And unfortunately, Gordon's files indicate that they are triggered by infrared beams. They won't be visible until you trip them. <laughs> Got a view of Flass. He's in a separate building. Ah, that could be problematic. How so? Gordon's files show that the only access to the neighboring building is via Falcone's office. 
Apparently, it's reserved strictly for less savory activities. Looks like Falcone's office is occupied. The gentleman in Falcone's office is likely Gordon's informant. A certain Walter Feister. If so, he'll undoubtedly know how to gain access to the elevator. Then I'll have a talk with him. I've put a data tap on the system. The security cameras could come in handy. Of course, sir, but a word of warning. It appears that Feister is not alone. Maybe I'll give him a little privacy. the nearest security video to your onboard system. Do the cameras have an infrared wavelength? Yes. The Vantage should allow you to see and avoid the trigger beams.
Need to get next door. I'm looking for a crooked detective named Flass. Who? You, you work for Falcone? No, I'm a hell of a lot worse. How do I get next door? Don't, don't hurt me. There's a construction job. I don't think it works anymore. But that door will get you to it. The security code is one three three seven. You ratted out your friend. <laughs> I just saw an angle and used it. Please. I don't deserve to die. If I let you live, you owe Gordon your life. You tell him everything you know. Whatever you say. Please. I, I can't handle pain.
You always say that. Not like this, I don't. I'm out of here. What, the market? The market, the life, Gotham. Getting leaned on by Falcone was bad enough. But now that he's gone, things are just getting worse. You ain't been handling that blue powder, have you? I don't it messes with your head. Nah, nah. I'm not getting anywhere near that doctor or his damn chemicals. I'm getting I'm through. Abandoning ship. Exactly. Time for the rats to swim away before the sea sinks. Exist. I didn't want to find him anyway. Master Bruce, the heat and force resistance of your body armor. Set its limits. You're telling me not to blow up anything I'm sitting on top of? Precisely, sir. I think Flass knows he's in over his head. Flass has been dirty since forever. He knows how the game is playing. He's been shook up, though. This mysterious doctor suddenly stirring the pot. Got whatever that bat thing is on top of everything else. Gotham's always been a sewer. Yeah, maybe. Getting a lot stranger though.
We're in trouble. We're in serious trouble. What do we do? We'll be all right. You blinded me! What the hell kind of Van stopped. There's definitely somebody in there. Why don't you go check? Just crazy. You watch what's going on. Yeah, I like to watch. What's Crane doing? Who's he working for? Crane's not my business. I can make him your business. One word, and you're back in Arkham. I've already got business, Detective. What? You. Waking in my boots. Which of us is holding a gun? Which of us chained to the damn wall? I'm not scared of you, Zaz. <laughs> you learn. Who is Crane working for? Who is Crane working for? Come a little closer. I'm warning you, Zaz. Just a little. Kill us? Calm the hell down. Got ah! a freaking chance of that. Oh! 
Oh, detective. This is gonna be some sweet hell. Don't hurt me. Why would I? That's what Zaz is here for. Just keep me alive. Yes, slowly. And I don't want to have to watch him do it. So I hope you're feeling talkative. What do you want to know? Falcone split his shipment in two. Only half of it was drugs. What was the rest? Some kind of chemical. Something hidden. It goes to the Narrows. To who? An, an, an Arkham doctor. His name's Crane. Jonathan Crane. What's the chemical? I don't know. I swear to God. Swear to me. Where is Crane? The Narrows. I don't know where the doctor is, but the toxin's being relayed from the abandoned science museum. If you find the chemical shipment, you can find Crane. Alfred, I'm outside the museum. There are reports of a helicopter on the roof of the archive warehouse, directly behind the museum. The head's got to be worth something. Forget the dinosaur, man. It's a plaster cast. Besides, how the hell would we get it done? We could figure out a way. It's supposed to be next door. Are you kidding me? Lucky that didn't kill us. That wasn't luck. What? We're being toyed with. Some kind of... Ooh, huh.
just a man. Used to be all right. Yeah, all right. Dumb as a post, but all right. What happened? You didn't hear? Tom dosed himself. With what? 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 <laughs> Who I am. The Batman, please don't eat my soul. That's a new one. <laughs> Where's Dr. Crane? I, I don't know. He's keeping everything under wraps. Whoever he's working for has got him spooked. Who does know <laughs> where to find Crane? The pilot. There's an Arkham pilot on the roof. He's moving the toxin from Crane to us. He can lead you to him. What's the toxin? What's Crane planning? I don't know. Some kind of poison. The guys who've been handling it have been seeing things. They don't sleep. They talk about demons and boogeymen. Who's Crane working for? I don't know. It's not Falcone. I don't know anything else. <coughs> Sounds like I need to have a conversation with that helicopter pilot. If I may, sir, so long as he has a clear escape route, what reason does he have to talk? Right. I'll handicap the helicopter first. Make sure he stays put until I tell him otherwise.
That wasn't an accident. There's something out there. You don't know that. How can you even doubt it? I was just imagining that. What in the name of... Something's up. Oh man, oh man. I don't like this. What did you do? Uh, 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 Oh! 
about that stuff, man. You don't want to get it on your hands. Green said it's not dangerous until he's processed it. You want to believe that? Tell it to those Frankenstein gimps in the red jumpsuits. Bald-headed things? Yeah, them. have to keep their hands shaved. Scalp themselves. You should have given us gloves. Money and Show a little patience. I don't like waiting. What if the cops show up? How long does it take you to get that bird airborne? Ten seconds. Tell me where your boss is. What the? I don't know what you're talking about. I don't work for anybody. Lies! You work for Dr. Jonathan Crane. And you're gonna tell me where he is. I can't. 
Crane's got my brother in this hospital. Whatever you do to me, he'll do worse to Walter. If I let you go, leave Gotham. Don't come back. Never talk to Dr. Crane again. If he knows I'm coming, I'll know it was you. Okay, whatever you say. I swear, you'll never see me again. Thank you. You won't regret this. That was unexpected. He's gonna try to use me as leverage to get his brother released from Arkham. I'll hitch a ride once the helicopter's airborne. He'll lead me right to Dr. Crane. There's a lack of mercy I expect from you, sir. I called Mr. Fox when your condition worsened. He synthesized an antidote. I felt these effects before, but never so strong. Patients suffering delusional episodes often focus their paranoia on an external tormentor. In this case, a scarecrow. Rachel's inside Arkham Asylum, trying to tie Dr. Crane to Falcone. I have to protect her. This is where we make the medicine. Perhaps you should have some. Clear your head. Alfred, I need a way to get inside the asylum. Might I suggest donning a pair of tights and pretending you're a Batsa? Cute. How do I get to Rachel? Miss Dawes is undoubtedly being held somewhere in the basement. Although I'd advise against a frontal assault, sir. The main gates appear to be well nigh crawling with Crane's criminals. Gas charges up top, aren't we? Yeah, but it's to room 45, the storage. Probably some kind of a backup thing.
kidding me? What? You got a car alarm? Can't stand that crap. So don't touch my car. I haven't had six straight hours of sleep in a month. Because of those things. Got my nerves all jangly. See what I'm talking about? We didn't do that. Somebody's here. You see anybody? Shut up. Dr. Thomas, thank you for bringing your concerns regarding Dr. Crane's behavior to the board. Your allegations are indeed disturbing and, frankly, hard to believe, if not outright fantastic. Dr. Crane is a highly respected and longtime member of our staff. We hope that you have not made these accusations lightly and urge you not to make them publicly. Since the board does not handle interpersonal matters, I have taken the liberty of forwarding your note to Human Resources. I suggest that you thoroughly document Dr. Crane's alleged threats and behavior for your own protection, should legal action be required by either party. Regards, Doug Hunter, Ph.D. Jonathan here. Listen, call me. I couldn't really make sense of your message, but if you think you're in danger, then get out of there. Seriously, call me. This is a message for Dr. Thomas from Arkham HR. Your concerns about another doctor's experiments really are in our jurisdiction. We've passed them along to internal reviews. But we're happy to update your security code. Your new digits are 4563. Make sure you've erased this message once you've noted the code. a security gate in my way. Yes, sir. The silent plans show a more than adequate lockdown system in place. Can they be opened remotely? I'm afraid not, sir. You'll have to find some other way around. insist on you drug crazed gimps as his guard dogs. Okay. Nah. You can scare an animal. Control it. These things though. I don't know what they are. What do you think he sees anyway? What? That poor bastard? Yeah. I don't wanna know. Hey, do you know what Crane ended up doing with the rabbits? Throw them out, I imagine. Damn. I was thinking. Ah! 
Up and get it fixed. I don't like being out in the open like this. Don't rush me. I don't want to be here when that thing shows up. That whatever demon. He ain't a demon. It's a guy in a mask. Besides, we got Jason watching out for us. Who? Campbell? That guy could. So jumpy. You don't really believe in the Batman, do you? Nah. All I know is Crane's scared. And whatever scares him sure as hell scares me. What do you mean? The doc seems like the usual creepy neurotic. How many of us has got here? away from me. I ain't scared of you.
Alfred, find out what you can on a Dr. Emma Thomas. She has information on Crane. Right away, sir. And I'll need you to locate the brain surgery theater on my radar. That's where they're keeping her. Done, sir. Gotta be something edible in this Just place. grab something and let's go. We got work to do. Give me a second. I just want to find something that doesn't look like my grandmother already ate it. Oh, I can't believe they were allowed to feed the loonies this garbage. Anybody smell gas? If I may, sir, that sounds remarkably like a gas leak. I nearly had a heart attack. I There, Dr. Thomas. Maybe you're feeling more talkative now? Believe me, you'd rather talk to me than Crane. Still feeling curious. Feel free to sample one of those gas canisters. Give us a laugh.
Somebody there? Stay put, Doc. I'll be right back. What in the name of... Oh! <clears throat> I'm here to help. Where's Crane? Tell me where Crane is. There's a way. Good. Stay put and wait for help. Where you are is as safe as you'll get. Alfred, what's my current position in relation to Arkham's power grid? Almost directly atop it, sir. Might I ask what you're planning? I'm gonna crack open that water tower. Use it to short out the power. Excellent idea, sir. Locate room 45 on my radar. The men at the front gates were talking about storing explosives. Right away, Master Bruce. Let no man underestimate your appetite for destruction. Oh! <laughs> 
The asylum still has electricity. Those will be the backup generators, sir, which unfortunately have just enough power to keep the security gates sealed. Just enough? Precisely, sir. The asylum's electricity is cobbled together from a dozen jury rig systems. You'll never kill the power entirely. But if you activate enough systems at once, you could overload it and create considerable chaos. <laughs> Something strange is going on! He's here. Who? The Batman. What do we do? What anyone does when a prowler comes around. Call the police. I need you to locate Arkham circuit breaker boxes. The asylum's electrical system is already in chaos, Master Bruce. It can always get worse. Oh. Never the optimist. You'll find them on your radar, sir. Alfred, I saw Rachel. She's alive. Can you get to her, sir? Not from here. I'll find another way. What use are you to me? You're real? Don't... don't... I'll do anything! Is that all you're good for? The elevator head is locked. The key code to make it work is 5839. You can use that, right? 5839. What's the holdup? Must be the lift's emergency brakes. I fixed the elevator. Uh, I mean, it should be working, but the release lever got stuck by the power surge. So unstick it. I'm not strong enough. Let me think. down there. Holy! You get this thing fixed? Ow! Oh, my life! Driving me crazy. I gotta try to get this sorted out. Sort what? The electricity, the flickering lights. Feels like we're in a cheap slasher movie. Can you cover things while I'm gone? I can't look in two directions at once. Great thing we had to. You can handle it. I'll be back in a few minutes.
Terrible. I know. I, I feel terrible. Listen, maybe I could hold on to the gun for a little while. Get out of here. Come on. It'd make me feel better. I'm not giving you the gun. But it would. Really? No. Get your own gun. for Dr. Jonathan Crane. <laughs> You're gonna help me. Take it! <laughs> Take it! <laughs> oh. ah. Cops? Exactly. They can't stop us, but the Batman has a talent for disruption. Hold him off until they arrive, and they'll take care of him. What about the girl? I very much doubt Batman's arrival on her heels was coincidence. Grab her, follow me. Well, what about us? What about that bat creature? I heard he can fly. I heard he can disappear. You'll wait here for him. If 
find out if he can die. Let's go. Shouldn't we move those canisters? Shh. I got a bad feeling. But I've seen those things. I don't know, man. I think I can feel something. You're imagining things. Crane says it doesn't work until it's a gas. You're telling me you don't feel just a little funny? Listen, we've been doing this for three days now. Gotham's water supply is thick with this garbage. If it made you crazy, every man, woman, and child in the city would be howling at the moon. Spreading toxins into the city through the water pipes. I need a map. To trace the contamination, sir? No. It's too late to stop it. But I can use the sewers to get deeper into the asylum.
on the bad man. Of course he can be killed. Well, if he isn't human. He is nothing but a man exploiting your superstitions and your fears. You have him outnumbered and you know he's coming. Quickly. I don't like this man. Messed up. Mother of my eyes.
bit overkill for Mandel Hospital. Timely as always. Now, listen carefully. You and I are the sole survivors of Batman's lunatic rampage on the hospital. I saved your life, yes? The Batman tried to kill us all, and I saved you. The, the Batman. Who is he? What do you know about the Batman? Did he send you here? Who else knows? Talk, damn you. Force. Repeat, all personnel. Can that garbage, Malkowitz. If you have to shoot, shoot to wound. We're not here to kill anybody. I need your help. She's been poisoned with a panic inducing toxin. I'll take her to the medics. The medics can't help her, but I can. Get her downstairs. Meet me in the alley on the narrow side. What the hell is going on? Dr. Jonathan Crane. You'll find him in damp trousers in that office. He was the third man at the docks. Crane was smuggling his toxin hidden in Falcone's drugs, refining and testing them here, then dumping them into the water supply. What's he planning? Who's he working for? I don't know. Someone dangerous. Get her downstairs. She doesn't have much time.
there until we get reinforcements. Negative visual. Yeah, copy that. Switching to channel 9. I don't even know, man. This place is an absolute nightmare. Whatever. I'm covering my own six. I plan on walking out of here at the end of the night. Stay with me. I need you to be tough for me. I'll take her. Take my car. I brought mine. You've been poisoned. Stay calm. Make it color. Buy some black. Tank. Turn off your engine. Step away from the car. Short, Alfred. Rachel doesn't have much time. Gordon's helping as he can, but you'll need to reach Gotham Battery Tunnel before it's blocked by a rifle. What about helicopters? Incoming, coming, sir. If one of the onboard SWAT snipers hit you with a tracking device, escape will be impossible. At 11.82, police vehicle down, no injuries. All available units in pursuit. Dispatch, where's my riot van? Tell Gordon we got the riot van incoming. I want that riot van to ignore dispatch. Take the Gotham battery tunnel. 7914, we've got visual on suspect. Going after him. Unharmed. We're out of the 
the chase. Car 375 is toast. We have two helicopter patrols incoming. Two minute ETA on, inbound shot. Alfred, I need you to prepare the antidote. 
Rachel's state is critical. It's way too close, Bruce. All that remains is to get her here in time. Why is this happening to me? Where am I? It's too... to the things I have to keep hidden. I can't tell her. Crane was a puppet. Falcone too. Whoever's pulling their strings. Whatever it is that's coming to Gotham. Is Raz al Ghul immortal? Are his methods supernatural? Or cheap parlor tricks to conceal your true identity, Raz? Crane was working for you. His toxin is derived from our blue poppies. He weaponized it. But Crane knows nothing of the League of Shadows. He thinks we'll hold the city to ransom. Gotham will tear itself apart through fear. Why are you holding back? Kill these men easily. They'll destroy thousands of lives. Millions of lives. Gotham cannot be allowed to survive. It is the breeding ground for crime and suffering. Gotham is the heart of modern decadence and filth. We must rip that heart from our chest. I told you better than that, Wayne. Gotham can be saved. Not this time. And all those dead innocents? Innocents? No. Sacrifices. Like your parents. Like you. Still not learn to mind your surroundings as well as your opponent. This isn't over, Dakar. My name is Raz Al Ghul, and for you, this is very much over. Goodbye, Wayne.
Alfred. Master Bruce. Are you all right? Of course, Master Bruce. Mr. Fox, however, appears to be in something of a bind. Lucius, where is he? In the kitchen, surrounded by flames. I couldn't reach- I'll save him. Then I'm coming to you. I'm by the grand piano, sir. Hurry. in one piece? Barely. You? Don't ask. We're in serious trouble.
What are you still doing here? I was nearly killed by some maniac in black pajamas. You have to get out of here. We need to manufacture your neurotoxin antidote on a large scale. That would take weeks. We don't have weeks. The toxin's already been dispersed. It's in our water supply. That doesn't make any sense. The toxin's an inhalant. Putting it in the water wouldn't work. Unless... What? Unless you had a microwave emitter powerful enough to vaporize the whole system kind recently stolen from Wayne Enterprise. Stay there! I'll find a way out for you! Damn it! Open! Not getting any cooler down here. Wayne, quickly. Well done. Now save your own hide. Alfred, are you still alive? No, sir, but loyal as always, and waiting by the piano. I'll be there. I hope you didn't rush your mic out, sir. Tomorrow the world will watch in horror as its greatest city destroys itself. Time to spread the word. And the word is... Panic. Follows the water mains to the central hub beneath Wayne Tower. Sir, there appears to be a panic about the narrow iron bridge. There's a panic about the entire island. Ra's al Ghul's already vaporized the toxin. Of course, sir. 
but the crisis at hand is keeping it from spreading into Gotham proper. Someone is lowering the Narrowborough Bridge. Mobs poisoned by Crane's toxin could spill into the city. I'll stop the bridge. I'll put the control tower on your radar. And the uh, Batmobile? It stays on the tracks. The monorail can't reach Gotham without crossing that point. If I can't stop the train, the Batmobile's auto-destruct is my failsafe. Batman, come to join my tea party. Crane. Oh no. Scarecrow. A few more minutes and the bridge will be down and Gotham will have so many more psychopaths than just you and I. I'm through playing games, Crane. Life is a game. So yes, maybe you are. survive impossible. I'm going after Raz Al Ghul on the microwave emitter. I need any information you can find. Of 
Control yourself, fool. the barrier but we're not Wayne is getting closer we blow the barrier now it's him blow the barrier <laughs> <laughs>
trying to find somebody. All of our officers... Has it spread beyond the Narrows yet? I don't know the situation, ma'am. If you could just find a safe place... They say you're not mortal. They say you can't die. How much you want to... I you wish you could. Ah! Nice work. Talk therapy. You've seen the device that's causing all of this. Something they loaded onto the monorail. Yeah. I found the control station. They only have one train running. I think the tracks are blockaded to keep them out of Gotham. Not anymore. I need to get on that train. The monorail controls didn't look that complicated. I could probably stop the train long enough for you to get on board. I don't want you to endanger yourself. Nobody's safe until this is over. Wait. You could die. At least tell me your name. It's not who I am underneath. But what I do that defines me. Bruce? Alfred, patch into the monorail control station. To contact Miss Rachel. Right. I need to know when she stops the train. Of course, sir. But be warned, your father built those trains to be driven, not remotely controlled. She'll only be able to stop it for a few moments at most. in position. Let's see. 
disarm the explosives on the carriage doors. You can't stop Al Ghul. It's too late. Then there's no reason for you to suffer to protect him. Suffer what? You don't want to find out. How do I disarm the charges? One, nine, four, two. That's the code. You'll live to see your precious Gotham a living hell! You can't stop Al Ghul! You took my advice about theatricality a bit literally, don't you think? We both wear masks. But yours is a lie. You hate this city as much as I do, but you're afraid to do what's necessary. That's why you cannot fight injustice, and why you cannot stop this train. Who said anything about stopping it? Then you will die with the rest of them. There's only one man I'll let you kill. <laughs>
what is necessary. I told you there's only one man I've let you kill. If not murder, what do you call this? Justice. Alfred, detonate the Batmobile. Are you quite certain, Hostiles? It's our only choice. Blow it. I once made the mistake of thinking Ra's al Ghul was dead. But when men make themselves symbols, they shed their mortality. Henry Descartes and Jonathan Crane are already gone. Just like Bruce Wayne. He's only a mask. A cover for the face criminals now fear. All that's left is Batman.